Hello. All guys up on these little pedestals have got to be out before I start dealing with this crap. Getting a level 50 combo is so ridiculously harder than I thought it was. It makes me mad so easily. I should have called first. No, you don't see me. You just thought you did. What's that? Goodbye. Last one right here, I believe. I'm not getting the close-up now, either. I didn't want him to go that far. It still worked, though. That was nice. People around here work. Ain't gonna rest on Friendly neighborhood Spider-Man just dropping by. Who's left? More over here. I'm gonna lose this eight combo and it's gonna make me mad. Yep, there it goes. No talking during the infiltration. <laughs> no talking during the infiltration. I love that. Hey, man. Spider-Man, I want him dead. Yeah, I'm sure you all want me dead. I already got no words. I already got four people off the building, huh? Nice. Oh, I got all five. Even better. All right, impact web counts to my combo, so use it as is necessary. No. Come here. That Molotov had hit me midair, I might have actually, like, lost my mind. Typical New York. A vacancy opens up and everyone's rushing to take it. I need you guys out of here before you mess up. Okay, there was a guy behind me, apparently. Nope. Throw that. Thank you. Stun him. Get to 50. Just get to 50. More of them? Guys, this isn't necessary. I'm already scared straight. Nope. Invisibility frames to get the last. Got it. There we go. There. Was that so hard? Spider-Man, I've spoken to people on the block. When the escape people tried to break into their building. Fits with what I heard. They want to take one over. They'll be a lot easier to deal with on the street without hostage. I'm working on it. Talk to you soon. Get out of here, you nerds. I don't have to worry about losing my combo anymore, thank goodness. What the heck? Okay, you guys sing Tuwa, and I'll sing Lee. Sing what? I didn't even hear what he was saying there. I'm sure it was hilarious, though, knowing Spidey. All right. Not great. They're all over there. You did not have your whatchamacallit up to be able to do that. Screw off with that. Make sure they get out of here. That's fine. Sup at your boy. Alright. Spider drone, what's in this? Yeah, what is he doing, Owen? Just unleash them all, who even cares? Oh, there's a grenade right there? Yeah, I didn't notice that until the last second. I do love the flashbang grenade effect whenever you're in the middle of uh, hey, taking down some fools. We don't have backup or reinforcements here. Just people. You dig? Stay there. All right. Begin with this? Come on, man. I'm so tired of RPG boys. Goodbye to you. Oh, I'm not a big boy. Who keeps inviting these absolute units? Did you see them, like, dance backwards from me? That was hilarious. This is not what I thought I had equipped. I thought I had electro webs. I disagree, to be honest. Come here. Nope, not this time. Oh, what the heck? Hey, bud. Goodbye, bud. You're out. So's your friend. This is the last wave, ain't it? Thanks for running into him like a bunch of idiots. Yeah, just keep getting closer. Nice. Let's go. Being able to use anti-grav on brutes is wonderful. Enjoy your fall, guys. I think we've done it. Easy success. Back in the slammer. Captain, the block's quiet. Everyone in an orange jumpsuit is down for the count. Great job. If they'd gotten into a residential building, they'd have done a lot of damage. Sick, we've done it. We are all done. Whoops. 
good news. A Riker's escapee we picked up says they've stopped establishing bases. What brought that on? You. They decided the bases make them too easy to find. They've gone back on the run. Smaller groups. Picking them off a few at a time takes longer, but it's safer. Especially for New York. Exactly. Nice going. Another one done. I'm not gonna do uh, what's his face right now. Let's go do the main mission, I think. We're at the point now where we kind of like have very little to do other than main mission spam. So we're definitely doing at least two today, maybe three. The main missions in this game last a lot longer than I thought they would, I'll be honest. I didn't think there would be as many as there have been, which is a good thing. I wouldn't have mind if there were a few less, but I uh, also appreciate there being more than I anticipated. I know that they're giving me that's the last crime right there that I need to do, but like we only have one crime to go now, so it's the exact opposite of how it was like four sessions ago. I really don't care because we'll get one to spawn so easily. We can do it whenever we want. So for now, I'm just going to focus on this main mission. Let's go. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Hopefully this is the last time we have to play as Mary Jane. Again, I don't hate it. I'm just, I'd, I'd rather not. I don't mind doing it, but I'd prefer just getting to play as Spidey and maybe Miles. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Yeah, we'll just do that. No problem. Mayor Osborne really lives here? There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Yeah, let's do it. Time to get people mad. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Oh, MJ. You're about as good at starting a riot as, uh, as Chit Sang. He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security. No sweeps needed, they say. Plus, you know, he's the mayor. Off limits, ma'am. I didn't mean to get that close to you. Hey, let me... Can I press triangle? Thank you. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on. Let's go talk to security. Yeah, go talk to him. What could go wrong? That should do it. Oh, is that enough? All right. Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet to you. I love me some tasing. Have to stealth take down them, huh? <sighs> multi million dollars. Yep, multi million, dude. <laughs> I like this thing. Yeah, I'd imagine you would. Gotta turn him around. Ah, uh, not the lure stuff again. Control, I heard something. Running a sweep. Good boy. You didn't hear nothing. You think these suits offers workman's comp? You think these suits would give you some kind of electricity resistance? Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the sable agent. But you would be wrong. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Let's do it. Do I have to go all the way back around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I can't... Oh, I bet I was supposed to go through this door, but I accidentally went around. That's fine.
Penthouse elevator. This is it. Sector clear. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Yeah, fire him immediately. Stupid, useless button. Hmm. <sighs> Not a very good agent there. Thought you saw something, didn't think ah, I can take three steps to my right and look in the corner. What a failure. Do I ever get to fight Silver Sable in this game? Or maybe she's being saved for DLC? I don't know. Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Let's do it. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Is there anything else other than that I can look at? Ooh, what's this? Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Yeah, very rude of them, to MJ, be honest. Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Yeah, must be. Unless it's something else, I don't know. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Unfort? Anything else to look at? Why does he also have these weird demon masks? That one over there looked the most important, which is why I'm saving it for last. Because I'm afraid, like with Doc Ock, I think I missed like one or two things I could have explored in his room because I inspected the thing that started the bomb too soon. So I'm trying to make sure I don't make that mistake again. But I think we've got everything now. Yeah, it looks like we're down to the last thing. Alright, let's see what this is. What is this thing? What the heck? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Is this the future Green Goblin mask? I don't think Green Goblin is in this game, but you know... There's little doubt that Insomniac is going to make a sequel to this game since this one is so incredible and has done so well. And, uh, I mean, they got cut. They still have plenty of options to go for the next game. They didn't use Mysterio in this one. I don't think they're going to use the Goblin. I highly doubt they're going to use Venom. It'd be, it'd be pretty bad if they brought him in this late. So there are, like, quite a few big bad options to use for future uh, Spidey games. Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Yeah, yeah, this could eventually become a goblin mask. I wouldn't be surprised. All right, let's do this. The fabulous Osborne boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Yeah, apparently. Why did I have to pull this down? Why couldn't I just move the picture? <laughs> what do we got here? Ooh, okay. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. Why would Harry's journal be left here? Would he not take it with him? Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms and a motto. Pax and Bellow. Peace in war. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. What does Pax and Bello mean? his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? To staff, Mayor Osborne has sealed his son Harry's room for the duration of his trip to Europe. The mayor will be keeping the key to the room in his possession. Absolutely no access to Harry's room will be granted without Mayor Osborne's express permission. Thank you, personal assistant to Mayor Osborne. If Osborne's got it on him, there's no way I'm getting it. 
Is that Harry's room through there? Oh, I can go this way. Okay. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Yeah, he sucks. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad. You know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Alright. Can't believe that that's a... Uh... Uh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza. Not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. What do you got against pool? Like, pools are cool. I mean, obviously Norman is, you know, living in the lap of luxury, etc., etc. Towns in crisis. But, like, come on. Who doesn't want a pool? Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. <laughs> That's what you get for living in New York. Going all the way over there, huh? Ooh, what's this? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Inside the friendship reshaping our world. That's Norman, right? Otto used to have a beard and mustache combo. Why'd he get rid of it? Probably because he wouldn't look as good with, uh... He wouldn't look as comic-like if he still had it in this game. Wouldn't look like he did in the comics, you know? Can't let that happen. Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Uh, come on. Of course Harry's been tested, and he's probably positive. This is not easy to read, but I'm gonna try... To whom it may concern, I am writing on behalf of my patient, Emily Osborne, to document the medical necessity of your experimental... Imi... I can't read it. Immunoglobin? Something like that? It's hard to see the word, let alone read it. Therapy. Uh, PM237 for the treatment of... Okay, you know what? You know what? If you guys really want to read this, I'm sorry. You're going to have to pause the video and try your best, because I already don't care enough to keep trying to do this. Especially not in video. I might try and read it when I edit the video. Why do so many people use these tape recorders in this universe? And then just leave them lying around? Happy birthday, dear. Sorry, I'm a little late. It's been a busy month. I miss you, Em. Especially today. I've put Harry... <sighs> I've sent him away. For treatment. We'll fix him, Em. I promise. Development of GR-27 was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? What do you think? He's got the same disease. Was this tree planted for the for uh, Emily Osborne and the key is in it? Harry's mom planted this when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Beautiful. Yeah, but is there a key in it, though? No? Okay. So we need to find out where, like, what Norman means by where Emily is, because she has the key to Harry's room, and then Harry's room has the journal, which has the date of his leaving. Can we not just call Peter and be like, hey, Peter, you know when he left? And then Peter would probably be like, oh, yeah, I remember. It was, like, August 14th. What are you talking about? It seems like something Pete would remember. Anything to inspect around here? Ah, the television. Yes, of course. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. 
funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Yeah, different worlds and all that. Aha, this must be it. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. And then the Fire Nation attacked and it, it was just bad, man. Doesn't, uh, I'm pretty sure it's comic canon that MJ, her mom died or something and she has, like, big issues with her dad, if I remember right. said the key is with M. I wonder if he meant that literally. It's either here or it's the, uh... Here or it is the tree, I would think. Or it's something I haven't run into yet. 